Good morning, Wildcats. Today is Tuesday, March 7th, National Cereal Day. I'm Adrian Delia, and welcome to WCTZ News. Today's episode of WCTZ is sponsored by Brubaker Builders, custom home builder in, in Brevard County that specializes in hurricane-resistant construction. App applications for the West Shore SGA Whitworth Scholarship are now available to pick up in the front office, as well as in Lynn Bramlett's room, 2205. Applications are due to SGA sponsor Lynn Bramlett by April 3rd at 3.30. There will be a college fair at the Melbourne Auditorium today from 6 to 8 p.m. Scan the QR code on screen to sign up for StriveScan, which allow you, allows you to connect with colleges easily. For more information, see your English teacher or college specialist, Angela Feldbush, in the Media Center. The Omega Omicron chapter of the Zeta Phi Beta Sorority has scholarships available starting at $500 for all senior girls. Applications are due Friday. For more information, scan the QR code on screen. Former West Shore student and currently attending West Point Academy will have a table at lunch today and can speak to you about the opportunities that the military academies have to offer. Outdoor education students hope to make a splash by getting their boater's license. Now to Addie with the story. A new outdoor education class involves a curriculum of various life skills. This past week, they have been learning to get their boater's license. It's not really that hard, it's really easy as long as you just pay attention and the test should be like a, like a breezy, like hour long test. Oh, I'm so excited to take girls out on my boat. When I have my boating license, I can be like, let me drive the boat, it'll be super fun. We don't have the gym this week and instead of going outside, we were like trying to find something else to do. I guess you can use it for like jet skis and stuff, so maybe if I can find a jet ski to rent, but other than that, I don't have a boat. It's almost like getting my driver's license again. Um, it's, it's just monotonous and it's the same thing over and over again. I don't think I'm going to be able to use it for anything because I don't have a boat. I don't plan on getting a boat either. It's just really expensive. I've also never been on a boat um, and so I don't anticipate ever using the license. I'm just taking a, like a bunch of little quizzes and it's like four or six hours long. I, I'm afraid I'm going to fail and it's going to be really embarrassing. For WCTZ News, this has been Addie Carroll reporting. Thank you, Addie. Today's episode of WCTZ is also sponsored by Flying Burrito opening soon across from Melbourne High School. The Janice Cohen Humanitarian Scholarship is now available for all seniors. The scholarship application can be picked up from college specialist Angela Feldbush in the library or from the scholarship page of the West Shore Guidance webpage. The completed application can be returned to Laura Richardson in the front office. All NJHS members must submit $8 for their yearly dues by tomorrow or risk losing membership. West Shore will be hosting a Chipotle Spirit Night on Tuesday between 4 to 8 p.m. The address is 1563 West New Haven Ave, Melbourne, and located in front of the mall. An admission representative from Nova Southeastern will be in the Media Center on Thursday at 1 p.m. for students who want more information about programs and scholarships at Nova. Get permission from your fifth period teacher and use the QR code on screen to sign up. See Ms. Felbush in the Media Center for more information. Thank you for tuning in to today's edition of WCTZ News, sponsored by Brubaker Builders and Flying Burrito. This has been Adrian Delia. Have a great day, Wildcats.